Why are we still in this castle? I thought you won the Castlevania. You won the Castlevania. Did you feel the need to return, Leon? Why are you here? Wait, are you, you're at, no, we're just talking to Leon now? We're just talking to Leon now. Okay. Is this canon? You know what? Actually, that's interesting. Like, in a kayfabe sense, why are you still here? What are you doing here? Get out of my house. But the game is built in just, such a way that just you're like supposed last to come time. back and do just it. Just like last time, where you were like, we're done recording. Why are you still in my house? And I said, well, I live here now. And I was like, you do? Jesus! Yeah, this will be perfect for the fire whip, boss. Good. That, that room we just completely missed because it had a, uh, you saw the door on the way in. It was one of those ones that needed switches. Yeah, so yeah. So when we originally came here, we, so we totally we, missed it. So we turned on all the switches, but we, we just didn't go through the door, huh? Because it's right back at the beginning of the area. Yeah, that makes sense. So, like, we just you never probably, returned to this place. You might have used the ticket to even leave this area for all we remember. For all we know. For all we remember. We weren't there when it happened. I wasn't. Yeah. I, you were barely here. Was it east or west? We still was, don't know. It was Weast. We, oh, I thought you said Weast. Damn it. I should have just trusted my gut. It was U-West. U-West. That, that was a fucking... That was good. That was a trip. Yeah, it was a real trip. So we've still, we've still got um, one boss and change left. Uh, we don't have any more bosses, so... Once we finish that one off and do whatever's left, it's just gonna kinda end. If we had known or if we were good... We would have rearranged done the one, the one remembered last. Yeah, as opposed to doing him, him like first. in this weird in the middle space. Yeah, it was a I, tough. I, and I, he's the th a much tougher boss than these whip guys. Yeah, well, I remember the decision was like, oh, I don't know how this game works. Is it gonna like auto cycle me into New Game Plus if I if I beat the la if I beat Walter? You no, know, you could do. And I was worried about that. What you know, could you I do? do? Once you have everything. And all the whips, you could do the boss rush and see how OP you the, are. Oh yeah, the boss rush is a thing, isn't it? Yeah, it was that like, might be it fun. Was right in the just to see like how how fast you could actually do it. Yeah, that might actually be fun, and it also might actually be difficult. the The boss rushes in the Ega games are oh. not always a walk in the park. Isn't but I'd be it? Down. Isn't it? Uh, maybe it's a boss rush in another game series or something. Isn't there games where boss rushes they add stuff? Like, they, add, they make like them a bit harder. patterns or, and stuff like that? Or they have new patterns, yeah. Yeah, I don't know it, if it was Castlevania, me. but I've, I've I definitely know, I heard know. of that before. I don't know which series. So, um, one thing that struck me while I was cutting together the last episode yeah. uh, of our cleanup was we were having a stirring discussion about what we thought of the story of this game. Yes. And then we just kind of stopped because we had to do a big cut. And we never got back to that. Mm. So what did you think of the story of this game? <laughs> oh, you actually had to cut like a, a good amount of it? Oh, no, I mean like we didn't finish. We cut oh, we ourselves really, off and we just, really, we didn't go anywhere with it. We got distracted by the video game. We, we listed playing. like three things we didn't like and then we talked about how the whip's kind of cool, I guess. And then we just stopped. Well, you either, you <laughs> either get really scintillating, well put together commentary if you do it yeah. post commentary so um where you can yeah not get distracted by a game that you're playing but yeah so well, editing editing over this footage by the way one thing that struck me was do you remember the scene where uh leon says tool uh, bag. The number of excess? that's really good i wish you had gone that way that's earlier. a startlingly good item you're gonna if those bosses are not changed up you're wow. gonna destroy them yeah um so one of the things I thought that that's a businessman is there's uh there's a, a bit where Leon tells uh, Matthias that his descendants will you know hunt him and stuff like that right yeah um which is a bold claim what if Leon never saw her as a child how what if how he quickly out? Leon moves on from the woman he just killed <laughs> yeah. like, like oh I'm gonna fuck more he just had to make the ultimate sacrifice and he's already thinking about his descendants let's go get started making another so, one so so either Leon already has a, a side bitch in mind or. He's just really, really angry okay. to the point where kids matter more than. I, I, I <laughs> would, would someone like that that makes that bold claim would they, kind of cheat by maybe just adopting a random street urchin, or do you think it has to be for the magicalness you, and like the honor he has to actually sire a new, a new? Are you saying the Belmonts are street urchins? <laughs> I'm saying, I'm saying like. Do you think if you're saying they could be? Yeah, but do you think a Belmont or like any heroic hero would be like, ah, fuck it, just adopt a child? I think he was pretty serious, and I think that he had a lot of angry sex. 
He's yeah. like he's like the Dio of Castlevania in a way. Yeah, he, where Dio a just a just sword. sired a million children because he uh, needs them. So it's like he's with some girl and she's like, "Wow, this is this is getting intense." And he just starts screaming Matthias in the middle of it, <laughs> and she's like, mm, "I see." I will cheer you on, Leon. And she's like, Work bit of a, hard. And she's like, bit of a quick shot, huh? And yeah. he's like, yes, fastest in the land. Yes. Need to make children quicker. My combat abilities are only rivaled by my sex abilities. And fastest he, and in he the land. And he puts on all these accessories during sex. Three make... accessories. <laughs> <laughs> if he's got his bag of tools handy, he gets three. Yeah, or he puts on like all the, the different pearls that enhance his powers or whatever. Swinging all four whips at the same yeah, time. Yeah, jeez. Using his, his be ability beads. Ability beads, God, yeah, exactly. you've really just been... And his tight leather, it's its all really just been building up to that, hasn't it? Sexvania. You know, that actually makes... Like, when you look at the deeper underpinnings of this character and story, mm. it really makes you think that Igarashi did think through how the Belmont line would continue in such an aggressive way. Maybe, maybe. Maybe there was a deeper meaning to this game all along that I Curse of know. Darkness just couldn't match. There are, there's there's not enough information, really. No. To, uh, to, to, to determine. It's the peeping eye. Ah, uh, okay, I forgot. Don't like, worry, he still... Has, he had his, his, his sumptuous back to me, I couldn't tell. Yeah, he got a hit in, but he's still more or less useless, so... Yeah. So we should be coming up on the next bit of progress, because I, I have been informed that it's near the second save room. And you're right you almost there. So it should be around here. And we're looking for one of those plant uh, enemies, you know? No, uh, I don't like Where those they guys. come out. Yeah, and, yeah. yeah, I know you don't like them. They're, they are quite scary. Disgusting. So maybe it's, it's in this room. Disgustingly scary. Not sure. There, well, that's a yeah, plant enemy. Yeah, okay. So there is a platform. Does he, is he going to have to, is he going to spit you out? Uh, and then there's a ghost face that's yeah, just the, like... The, the wisp, I remember that. The killer. So you jump up, and you jump up. What a helpful enemy. Look at that. And the ghost face is like, wait. Oh. <laughs> I'm still, still over still here. coming. A gauntlet. Jewel crush that uses up a jewel in your possession. And which is a mysterious effect. Well, I want to know what that accessory is. Yeah. Jewel crush. Do, is that like... How do I do it? Oh, a jewel in your possession. Like the rubies or like the... Um, you remember the zircons and the rubies and the items? Barely. You get? I think it's those. I mean, yeah, so, it's a jewel, so. so... We're still missing these. Jeez. Um, so, I guess it makes them use items? Uh, items... It's fun, it's like, you know, I... We have a zircon increases money. Okay. Uh... So, wait, okay, how much money do I have? I have 1,501. Yeah, okay, that just gives you... That just converts, like, smash the Zircon. Okay. That's a really neat item. Like, I, to, I think to, give, I... to give the, the jewels an actual purpose outside of... Oh, okay. Yeah, they don't really... Yeah. Right. Like, that's really smart in the sense that those items are literally just money items, but oh. now they're they're multi, multi-featured. multi Although I do think it's kind of disappointing to get an item that looks like it's going to be this cool, like, offensive gauntlet, and all it does is, like... Crush a thing and the give you a The offensive gauntlet of holding. Yeah. I, I've held Kill. things a legendary amount. <laughs> okay, let me uh, refer to my guide real quick. Um, Anti-Soul Mysteries Lab. No, that's the wrong one. Garden Forgotten by Time. Uh, we just got that. So, Thunder Whip. Uh, go north. Oh, same same situation. You gotta find another... another go, go, to, go south. Go south. I thought you said we... Yeah. <laughs> Been over this. Um, and also big ups to... It might uh, be this way. Not I sure believe it was uh, a lady fan on our Twitters that said, you really missed opportunity not calling your new office the anti-soul mystery lab. Yeah, that was <laughs> fucking strong. That is real strong. I don't know what it is about it. Uh, but uh, yeah, no. Castle Super Beast, as cool as it is. Not nearly as cool as anti soul Yeah, Lab. that's a very special name. I'm not sure... Or, or what was it? The Pagoda? The Pagoda of, like, pagoda Internal of, Damnation? I can't remember. So this is the, the Holy Water white ability, which that's just keeps enemies of, away. Yeah. It's... Not the most thrilling thing, but it's it's functional, I guess. All right, so it's probably the other way, the enemy I'm looking for. Yeah, you should have gone Sorth. 
I should have known you'd be right. As usual, uh, every, boss. Uh, no, I was going to say every so often when the moon bleeds red, I'll be right. About one thing. Yeah. Did you guys know I'm right? I'm right this time. I called it. Wait, what's I called the, it. Wait, what's the phase of the moon right now? Nah, it's... you're full of shit, dude. <laughs> yeah, you're right. I called it. Yeah, you're right. I called the Nintendo Switch, even though everyone in the world called that. Ah, here we go. Uh... It, did it just shoot out jewels, or were those yeah, bad things? Yeah, it did. Fuck you, peeping eyes. Don't make me nervous about your laser beams. That was a cool combo. Oh, it looked cool, at least. So I guess it's over here. Yeah, there it is. See it right well, up there in see. the top corner? The platform's up there. Oh, shit, barely. It, these Can things are it? really well hidden. No, I gotta use, oh, the, yeah, uh, use the plant guy. The plant guy. <laughs> Matthias or whatever, or whoever's left in this castle is like, oh, I should never have put those platforms there. It's uh, it's fun. Fun design, though. It would it would have been neat if they would have... Oh, oh shit. fuck, hurry up. It would have been neat if there was, like, a more obvious mandatory section that required that. Yeah, to let you... Yeah, exactly. To let you in on it, because I, I never would have suspected that. Are these new enemies? I don't know. I don't They're remember. just minotaur heads are on fire. I mean, it's a standard enemy. Yeah, and well, and yeah, these thunder swords are just recolors of other enemies, so... Yeah. Not exactly the most thrilling even by new enemy standards, so... Just put the thing on fire. I just have a floating crate. Just drag, if it's on fire, drag it's the cool. fire over to it. Okay, so there's a sword. This is actually new shit. Uh, this kind of looks like a Soul Calibur oh. Legends stage. Yeah, we should play through that game all the way. Uh, I used to think that, but then I thought about it. And Good then idea. I played it actually a little bit. Oh, so I just have to raise the swords up, I bet. I bet it's like as simple as that. Because the problem with that game, which I didn't really know, is that it's kind of like... A, just a really dull, almost wave-based thing. Where yeah. It's not like much of a constructed no, linear you, adventure. It's more like you walk through shitty a dungeon dungeons. crawler. Yeah, almost. you walk through shitty dungeons and you dungeon crawl shitty. But it's yeah, but it's shitty exactly. It's not it's like such a bummer too. It's oh, not like an, a cool action oh, adventure. Oh, how embarrassing! I, I I wish it was better than it is, honestly, because it's I I would love for Soul Calibur characters to get a non Soul Calibur like mainline game. Yeah. They they I, I think the characters are good enough to to hold that kind of thing. Does Soul Calibur be great with like like an RPG like party yeah. system? Yeah, it would. And it's a, let's say it's not really turn based. Let's just say it's like active time battle or something that's a little bit more. Well, it could be more of like a tactical game. I could. Uh, I, oh, I wouldn't really want a tactical game just because it, it's fighting game roots. I'd want something with a little more. Oh, I, I, not necessarily like grid, but like a okay. ring, ring based where they move around in open areas. Oh and yeah, stuff okay, like that. yeah, something that's, like that's, that. Something yeah. more Valkyria Chronicles than Fire Emblem. Mm -hmm. um, not that I wouldn't take either. This area is like really different from any area we've yeah, been to. Yeah, it's like secret. Oh, watch out for purple ghosties. Oh, I gotta run away from them. That's crazy. They'll probably massacre me. Yeah, have we have we seen any other like outdoors ish? Hard max up. Nice. Have we seen any other like outdoors ish environments like this? Uh, I guess the the garden in general is the most. Oh, the... when we're outside, remember we're on that big like terrace, and we could see outside oh, yeah, into that. the that. That's the only thing that comes right. to mind. Look, I got to whip onto the thing. That's cool. This is all like new concepts. It's all hidden away for those guys are like. Oh, people. we're so slow. We can't hit at all. What? I think the thunder clapped at the same time as I... You think? No, I don't know. I'm just... What, what is that? Maybe it'll become clear as we go through the area. Yeah, there's something up. Yeah, okay, yeah. I heard some uh, crack of thunder, but heard like... some shit. Oh, this, this new area... Whoa, you see his, like... The uh, shadow. The shadow on the yeah. wall. That's cool. That's the only thing that stays... That, that, this is actually this is a really, really like, cool. Castlevania-type thing that's, like, not really required. Uh, yeah, bummer that this, like, is underused, I like, guess. This but... would have been a good lead-up to the final boss, for Or something, for example. yeah, definitely. Is this, like, it's, 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 it looks so good, the effect, that they, yeah, they could have used it like anywhere. Like, generally, yeah. we're going back to the story thing that we still didn't really talk about, because we got distracted Yeah, we again. distracted ourselves. Is that, like, overall, I'm really disappointed with the final boss and the final enemy. Yeah, just death. Like, like Lords of Shadow did the same sort of thing where it's like you didn't really get like you know Dracula, you got who you got. Yeah. At the end, but like you know, it's it's 
it's not a main line it, it, or I, I would have I really know. dug if there was a big fight with Matthias at the end where there's a bit more like, like I expected that actually after death yeah with a bit more like gravitas on the idea of oh well I am Dracula now you know no but I think that Leon been nice. got angry at him and sent an angry thing and Matthias is just like yeah I'm I'm, out, I'm fucking Audi I'm out, I'm going to San Francisco start my vampire cult there seems like a nice place this time we'll of year. start up a software company called bloodlust software it'll be great it'll be great yeah i'll show you your children will never get anywhere close san francisco totally uh, being a thing in the 10th century so i suppose this is the boss right here i suppose so um so i will what's put... ring of thunder maybe that'll be i was gonna say i will put on resistance. the lightning resistant why'd you do that to make this fight even more of a joke yeah and i'll actually i'll take off the jade mask for this fight because i don't need it and i'll put on the drop near oh yeah i can't walk through these <laughs> they're too tough Electro! Wow! Or Shocker, if you're feeling nasty. Oh, his design's probably the better. It is, actually. He's probably better than the, the fire one. I, I would say about equal with the water one. I kind of forget what the water one even looked like. Yeah, okay. You're actually a bit lower on health than I thought. I am. I'm just gonna... Safe... Is that from his head, or I'm is just that... Gonna... No. no, it's from walking in like this. I'm just gonna <laughs> safety up a little bit. Safety up. I, I I don't. How do you feel about these guys being hidden? Because I think they're like I, I, think, I think they could have put at least one of them in the main I, game. I think hidden it. bosses are really cool. Um, but one one thing I always like with hidden bosses is, is like if there's a bunch of them, I like when one of them is a little easier to find, just to give you the yeah, idea that you're missing. That's what I was stuff. about to say. It'd be cool if there was one that was like. Because you could go through this whole game without ever knowing about these guys easily. Yeah. We didn't yeah. even we didn't come close to finding one. Like, yeah. Not. Yeah. We didn't get to a sec. Oh, wow. Not. Uh, yeah. Not too strong. It, but it would have been nice if one of them was a little closer to the to the beaten path. Uh, like the fire the fire one admittedly was pretty close actually. So maybe maybe that's the one and we just progressed. Maybe, funny. but still. Um, but yeah, like having no indication that there. Are, or right, let's any see, at let's all. see the thunder whip. I wonder what it's gonna. It's probably gonna be a whip. Yeah. With thunder. Like I don't actually think it's a flaw that we didn't Lightning. see any. Like that's on us. It was see electrocute. I'm gonna keep doing it until he says something. Oops. Mm hmm. Nope. Could they not think of a line? Could he not say shocking? Well, it's like, what? Are you going to make him say thunder? It's lightning. It's a totally different concept. Get shocked. No, that's not cool. You'll get a charge out of it. like. That's terrible. <laughs> yeah, worse. yeah, no, I wouldn't want to insult the scintillating dialogue of this yeah, game. Yeah, you're right. It's not even that great. It's great. Dialogue's not the problem. One thing I'll give Lords of Shadow is that generally it's script, especially during... um all Zobek shit that he that he speaks. It's like, it's well written. It At least he uses yeah. the language well. Uh, maybe there's a bit too much of it, but... But hey. Okay, let us check. So, there is also a door that we opened up, uh, mm. which is probably that one right there, actually. Mm. So let's uh, let's head right back down to that one. Okay. Because that was for pushing and pulling all these switches. Remember, they were right, right. unlocking one at a time. Um, down the stairs, yes. But yeah, aside from like being disappointed with the the final boss, it's like it's more like because this is supposedly the first in the timeline where oh, I it think is, it is actually, where I yeah. where I no sorry I don't mean supposedly I mean um, it's supposed to be it's it's it is yeah and that's why I think maybe I'm a little disappointed with like the non gravitas of this story yeah I th I think the um the finale of the game could have drawn gone for a bit more like high drama and yelling and stuff because because we were saying because this... it kind of ended a little limp after yeah yeah we were saying this the, the whole playthrough it's like man sure haven't had any story or cutscenes in a long time yeah and that was fine for the for the beginning of the game no, yeah. no worries actually it was like totally fun Oop. odd totally fine but then at the finale i think it was a little underwhelming with how little there was yeah um and I, 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 I think we did talk about this. I think the vampire killer was good. Yes. Like, the, the yeah. creation of the whip and, and that shit, that's good. The Crimson Stone establishing all that shit, that's, that's good and fine. It doesn't really get addressed in the future, but that's good, sure. And also your wife, girlfriend, slash whoever she is, 
like she was in one cutscene really and she didn't we, get much she didn't get much so when the hero is like oh, I care about her I'm like oh I don't because I haven't really seen anything yeah. or know about you and like yeah the woman in Lords of Shadow was already like already dead when the game starts like right when it's that game starts it's like oh she died yeah uh, but you get lots of little flashbacks and her ghost follows you around so you, at least you get a little bit more out of her like I still didn't care about her all that much but at least the hero was like well Gabriel's really mopey for the longest time where he Boy, like, keeps he? Ta- talking about it, but I guess that's the tragic Shakespearean style hero. Yeah. And Leon just more of like the, oh, how dare you hurt my property? Yeah, Leon doesn't, <laughs> like, there's not enough scenes for him to, to, to really, really change and grow as a character. Plus, he looks so you, you, stupid. They're all, they're all loaded game. towards the back. He looks so awesome in he the does, art, but he, he does looks look silly. Okay, cool. Red Phoenix Key, Red Phoenix huh? Key, piece of cake. I think now we've got all of the keys. Uh, I believe so. Yes, we do. Let me rearrange them. Oh, Look at yeah. all my keys. Look at that. All organized. The black nicely. turtle, the white tiger, the red Perfect. phoenix, the blue dragon, and we don't can't think of another thing for yellow, so it's just another dragon. So, the... <laughs> yeah, it's true, eh? I didn't even notice that. Uh, so, the one thing I noticed is that uh, getting the whips seems to be... Getting the whips and fighting that uh, secret boss who gives you the black gem. Yeah. They seem to be, like, the high points of the post-game. Um, and there don't seem to be many sections that use the keys at all. Like, there's no big, long hallway where you have to use all five keys or something oh, okay. sick like that. Yeah, that That'd sucks. be really awesome. So, uh, we are going to keep looking around because there's still a bunch of stuff and there's still some cool mysteries uh, to examine. Mysteries. Uh, but for now, we're going to have to move to the ghostly theater. So apparently there oh. is a secret in this room that we were too scared to move around in. Of course, it's fucking because, scary. because why would you investigate? Why, why would, would you, you risk? Why would you look around in this room? Yeah, it's too scary of a room, the meat Fuck. crusher room. Like you're just asking for trouble. Mm. Apparently there's a, oh, there it is. Oh, you there, see there. It? there's tons of shit. Okay, so I got to just move over there. Although, Ooh. you're taking hits, but it's really not hurting you. Am I, am I taking hits? You, you oh, sort wow. of are. Maybe you're supposed to get on top of it. God, get on top maybe. of the spikes. See, it's totally fine. Oh, it's not. <laughs> it's fucked. I'm taking oh. small amounts of damage. Do you see another like way to get up anywhere? Uh, no. All right, well, I will continue trying on this. Because I only tried it twice anyway, so... It's not like I gave no, it a lot of effort. That's, I think it might be on the other side. Yeah, like on the south. Yeah, like south there. Western corner of the room. Oh shit! Shit, don't. Jump. Uh, we can keep looking around, but. And this is the end right here. So. Uh, no, go back to go back to where the platform is. I just mean like that one spot in front of it, like or like. You mean like to the like kind of left of yes, it? Yes, yeah. You can check that, yeah. That seems to be the only time where the platform up above is a bit lower because there's no banister. I you think you I have. Mean? to... There you go. Yeah, okay, you have to use the whip to boost up anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. You did it, Matt. <laughs> you, you did. Thanks. It was all me. It was all you. I'm actually gonna use a potion though because I took a. You're took basically a, my a bunch vessel. of bumps. Oh Got yeah, HP, HP max up. up. Nothing's That's what gonna we be able to hurt you. I did fuck, I wasted my potion. But do you know LP what do you over. know what all this is for is activating crazy mode, which is like the the actual really it's hard the, the insane pretense difficulty. to it, yeah. I, in crazy mode, do you even get to keep all your shit? I'm sure you must. I wonder. Yeah, cuz Ega's games all do that where you could carry over and like completely destroy the difficulty man, of a hard. Who developed mode. this mode? It's some type of crazy man. Basically. So the white the white key is right up ahead, so. Yeah. We're really close to 100% map completion, actually. White, white, white tiger key. White, white why was it? White yeah, power, white tiger, white power, white power key. key. <laughs> Dracula votes for Trump. Yeah, he would. Although by the time this video goes up, I don't know. Oh God, you're right. <laughs> this video is going up to like- Put it up today, quickly. This video is going up on, oh, what day? The, the 9th, so yeah, it's gonna be too late. Well, let's just hope we don't. Let's just hope. Let's just hope we don't live in that future. Yeah. As Canadians, we're allowed to say these things. Yeah. No, you can't get mad at us. No, exactly. <laughs> Every other LPR has to tread around it. Yeah. yeah exactly. We decide. We opt to tread right through it. 
<laughs> All right, what's in here? What do we got? Oh, it's just an item room. Yeah, we got a heart brooch. Decreasing. Well, it's that is that is a really good item, but there's nothing else to use use it, it on. Fun, yeah. <laughs> that is a really good item though. Uh, and combined with the uh, the bloody cape, which gives you more hearts when you um. I got when the bloody damage, brooch and the bloody cape. These are good. So I like, got the raccoon so charm like, on the butt. What does my stuff cost right now? Yeah. Twenty. 12. Vanish storm. Okay, now if I put the accessory on. Hard brooch. 15. So minus 25%. That's, yeah, it's sizable considering how seldom you get them. But I'm going to keep the drop near on because. I, I don't know how anyone would say brooch when it clearly is it's brooch. brooch. Okay. Uh, probably going to have to whip something. Probably going to have to whip on something to get up on somewhere. I was just saying to Matt. When we were walking over here, there's a real pattern to these uh, to these secrets. If you see plants, jump on top. Yeah, the Get previous area was plants. This area is, Get on is top spike of rooms. Spikes. I think and it's over. I think it's spikes. over at the the northern oh. corner. Yeah, perfect. Well, crazy. This is actually like crazy mode. This one's a little more interesting. A little bit. MP max up, but then you go over here. There's even more. There's even more. You knew it. And this one sounded cool, but I don't know if it does anything. Lucifer's Sword. Unleashes an attack wave, ornamental piece not suited for battle. What the fuck does that last bit mean? S not suited for battle. Do so not use it. is that an accessor? No. Uh, go, to, uh, go to weapons? It's not a whip. Uh, no, wait, go back to weapons. It's not a whip. Oh. Uh, it's armor? Hang on. Is what it the fuck a are you? It's a relic. Oh, uh, you remember the relic category? You no. remember those things that we only got two of? I thought they would all be statues. I'm glad Lucifer's sword isn't just are, are, like a sticker you attach to your butt. Do all these relics really exist? No, there's no way. It that because it's this. It's just using the same menu as the orbs. What did that do? Tackle enemy for damage. It's a tackle. So do you just? Some type of rising tackle? You just... Oh, maybe when you there's an enemy, you, you just cause damage when that red halo's yeah, on I, you. Yeah, I'm gonna... When we, That's when we, weird. When we find an enemy, we'll fucking experiment with that. Tackle the, the spike walls. That'll work. You don't know. No, it didn't work. Didn't work. Damn it, you messed it up. I'm sure it can work. If you believe in yourself more. I do. Okay, I just gotta get to the end of the room and then we can test it. Ow! You'll never get there, you'll die. You'll die. The only exit? Yep. Why are you dying? Okay. Tackle. Yep. Wow. That's what it does. That's a really uninteresting move. What are you talking about? Like I guess Look when you. awesome it looks. That that's actually a lot more useful than the ones we've gotten. Cause... Wait, why did everything die? Oh, I, I picked up a Rosario that that enemy dropped. Oh right. Okay. Like the like the crisscrossies, you know. Um, that's a really uninteresting Lucifer's move. Lucifer's sword makes me kind of be a hurt yeah like it, it's it's <laughs> easily the best one we have but eh. like i thought it was gonna shoot a bunch of swords in like, one hoping. direction or something oh look it says this area is complete now nice that's actually really it's handy right, 99 percent. so we're missing very little honestly uh then there's the completely <laughs> dark room and the black turtle key yeah we totally did this area good job matt thanks